Welcome back to All the Mod 7. It's going to be a short video on how to make the Hephaestus smithing table. What do you need that for? Well, if you're like me and you got a tool that you never want to break, like this Morgan sword, you can craft this in Eternal Stella. You probably have these parts and pieces and you got to this point and you're like, how the heck do I do this? You click on here and nothing happens. So this video, I'm going to break it down on how to make the Hephaestus smithing table table, setup, apparatus, whatever you want to call it. Here's how you do it. It's very similar to the infusion altar from Mystical Agriculture as far as the layout's concerned, except you need this as a base. These are polished dark stone. You need nine arcane chiseled polished dark stone and four chiseled arcane polished dark stone. And you have to put them in this pattern. We're gonna take a smithing table and some Munda bitter dust. We're gonna pop the smithing table down right here in the middle. Put the dust in our hand, shift, right click, boom. We got the Hephaestus Forge. And then we need to add these dark stone pedestals. These are gonna go on top of the arcane chiseled polished dark stone blocks. It's like so. Now when I right click on here, I get a GUI. And if we look at this recipe, we know that we need 82 or real, one soul, and a thousand blood. We don't need any experience to do this recipe. Let's start with the or real. I have five bottles of this stuff. Pop it in right there. So we now have 175. That's plenty. Now we need to get blood. You need a test tube. And you need a mystical dagger. And for demonstration purposes, we're going to use our box made for the Morgan sword. Kill entities with the dagger. You'll fill up the test tube with blood. How peaceful. Thing that we need is some souls so you need to take some soul sand and a soul extractor and if you shift right click never mind you just right click on the soul sand hold down right click you'll get souls from the soul sand. So now all that we have to do is add our souls over here. That'll fill up the soul meter. And also add our blood over here. That'll fill up this blood meter. We need a thousand for each craft. We're good. We got everything set up. Now we just have to put a diamond in the middle. Take one stellarite piece. Two ex three expectrified orbs and you need a blacksmith gavel take that shift right click just right click on the altar you get the animation and six years later you get Eternal Stella. And if you take the Eternal Stella to a smithing table, put whatever item you want to make eternal in there, pop this in there, boom, it would make it eternal. But apparently, the mod pack developers don't like the Morgan Sword because this has 102 different items that you can make. Can't do the Morgan Sword. But hopefully, that helps you figure out how to do the Hephaestus smithing for forbidden and arcanus this is version 1.18 of minecraft thanks for checking out the video y'all have fun and peace